Picture this, the year is 862 and a group of Slavic tribes in Eastern Europe invite a Viking chieftain, Rurik, to rule over them. Rurik's leadership marked the formation of a state known as Kievan Rus, a loose federation of East Slavic and Finnic peoples in Europe from the late 9th to the mid 13th century. This is widely regarded as the birth of Russian history. Over time, Rurik's descendants developed and expanded the Kievan Rus, building it into a significant East Slavic state. But perhaps the most crucial moment in this early period came in the year 988 under the rule of Vladimir the Great. Vladimir adopted Orthodox Christianity from Byzantium, an event that profoundly shaped Russian culture, influencing its arts, literature, and very ethos. And so, as the Kievan Rus thrived and evolved, it laid the foundations of a nation that would one day become a global superpower. Fast forward to the 13th century and the Mongols storm into the scene, subjugating the Kievan Rus under their rule for over two centuries. This period, known as the Mongol Yoke, was a challenging era of tribute and turmoil, yet it's during this time that the city of Moscow began to rise. The Mongols, while ruthless, allowed a certain degree of autonomy to their subjects. Moscow's princes, shrewd and strategic, capitalized on this. They collected tributes on behalf of the Mongols, growing their wealth, influence and power. This, combined with Moscow's advantageous geographic location, led to its emergence as a political and spiritual center. As the Mongol Empire weakened, the Moscow princes saw an opportunity. They rallied their forces, encouraged by the Orthodox Church which proclaimed Moscow as the Third Rome, the new center of Christianity. In 1480, Ivan III, the Grand Duke of Moscow, overthrew the Mongols, marking the end of their rule. With the Mongols finally defeated, Moscow emerged as the epicenter of a unified Russian state. From the 15th century onwards, Russia began to expand its borders at an astonishing rate. The stage was set for this expansion under the reign of Ivan the Terrible, the first Tsar of Russia. His rule marked the conquest of Khanates of Kazan and Astrakhan, extending Russia's reach to the vast expanses of Siberia. Then enter Peter the Great, a transformative figure who established St. Petersburg as the new capital, shifting the power center from Moscow. His reign saw a modernized Russian army, a revamped navy and a reformed government, catapulting Russia onto the stage of major European powers. The torch of expansion was further carried by Catherine the Great. Her rule witnessed the annexation of vast territories, like Crimea and parts of Poland, molding Russia into an empire. Her reign was a testament to Russia's growing influence and power. By the end of the 18th century, Russia had transformed from a medieval state to one of Europe's leading empires. The 20th century brought dramatic changes to Russia, beginning with the fall of the Russian Empire and the rise of the Soviet Union. The Russian Revolution of 1917 marked a significant turning point as the Bolsheviks, led by Vladimir Lenin, dismantled the Tsarist autocracy and led the country towards a socialist future. This was the birth of the Soviet Union, a state that would dominate Eastern Europe and become a global superpower for the majority of the 20th century. Notable events during this era include World War II, where the Soviet Union played a decisive role in the defeat of Nazi Germany, and the Cold War, a tense and protracted ideological conflict with the United States that spanned over four decades. However, the Soviet Union was not to last. Economic difficulties, political struggles, and growing nationalistic sentiments led to a series of events in the late 20th century that culminated in its dissolution in 1991. This marked the end of the Cold War and left the United States as the world's sole superpower. From the ashes of the Soviet Union rose the Russian Federation. Under the leadership of figures like Boris Yeltsin and Vladimir Putin, modern Russia has navigated the post-Soviet era, grappling with economic reforms, political challenges, and a redefined role on the global stage. From the ashes of the Soviet Union rose the Russian Federation, a nation that continues to play a crucial role on the world stage. So, there you have it, a whirlwind tour of Russian history. We've journeyed from the birth of Russia with the formation of the Kievan Rus by Rurik, through the Mongol yoke, 
and the rise of Moscow. We've witnessed the expansion of Russia, its transformation under the Soviet era, and its evolution into the modern-day Russian Federation. From the rule of Viking chieftains to the reign of modern presidents, the history of Russia is a fascinating journey through time, full of triumphs, tragedies, and transformations.